Hi guys, so today I have a yard sale haul for you. It is the combination of um, this weekend and last weekend. And so let me show you what I got. So the first thing is this bag. And it, in it, it was just a dollar for this bag. And it's got all of these really cool, like rattan and twine balls, like for decoration, for decorative purposes. Um, there's another one. And then this one's really cool, it's metal. So we just got a ton of different textures going on here, which I absolutely love. So all of that, this one was in there as well. And this little bag of all sorts of little things. So I got, oh and these were in there too, there's a few of those. So I got all of those for a dollar, which I was really happy about because I actually have um, a little basket that I had hauled previously that I'm going to use to put those um, in. So that was great. That was just a dollar. Um, the next thing, this was actually at a thrift store at Savers, and I think I got 30% off. So I paid $3.14 for it. Um, but it is a really light cotton. Is it cotton? I think it's cotton. Made in India. Hold on. I think it's cotton. Or, um, I don't think it's linen gonna tell me it's 100% cotton um, and it's from Old Navy and it's this really light pale pink with these pretty I have to wash it and iron it but pretty roughly sleeves that go all the way down super pretty and then it's got this like trim right there at the top it's just really pretty and flowy and light for the summer so that was oh in the back has these pretty little buttons so that was just three dollars and fourteen cents I absolutely love that and then at one of the yard sales, I picked up this shirt. My son and my husband both have shirts like this right now in their sizes. But this size is like a size bigger for my son. So this was just, uh, I think I paid 75 cents for that. And it's in new condition. So that was great. Yeah. Okay. Daddy will get it. Um, the next one, the next yard sale I went to, I got this entire stack of clothing for $5. It's 11 pieces. Um, and it's actually for my niece because this was just, this was her size. And I was like, oh, it was, a, it was a really good deal for what they had. And they were all in great condition. So I paid $5 and I got 11 pieces. So less than 50 cents a piece for each item. The first one was a Crazy 8 spring jacket. Isn't this so cute? Like a little canvasy jacket. Look at the lining on the hood. It's just so cute and it is in like new condition. I didn't see any stains or rips or anything on it. So precious. So I got that. The next one I thought was really fun. It's got little pirate chips all over it. This is from Monto. So it's got the little striped sleeves and then little pirate ships all over it. It is just so cute. And then the, the next one, <coughs> excuse me, is this plaid for like the fall. And it's gathered like an empire waist. So I thought that was really cute for her. I think she'll really like that one as well. These are some Bermuda shorts for the summer. Hopefully they'll fit her now. So cute. And then this little shirt was, I don't know where this was from. There was really no tag where it said it was from. But it's like a little light sweater with the pretty detailing on the front of it. I thought that was really cute. This one, again, is another like plaid one for fall. This is Cat and Jack. So cute. And then this says Heart and Soul. And this is by Crazy Eights. It's just a little t-shirt. This one is cute for winter, cat and jacket again, with all the little snowflakes on it. It's got some glitter, some bling, and the back has snowflakes all over it as well. So, really cute. And cat and jacket is really nice stuff. The Crazy Eights is a really nice brand. So, this one is by Epic Threads. It's so cute. Look at the bottom of it. It's adorable. This one is the Crazy Eights. Smile for miles. So cute. And the last one 
was the crazy eights as well with the star. So again, all 11 pieces for $5, which makes them less than um, 50 cents a piece, which is just a, such a great deal. So I'm going to give my sister those and hopefully she can use those for the fall and winter for her little one. And then I did pick up this one. This was just 50 cents for my little one. Um, just because I do like sports days and things like that at her preschool, her little daycare. And so for 50 cents for a Celtics, we are New England. So that was perfect. So I grabbed that. Okay. Um, I did find this. Now they sell these at the Dollar Tree right now and they're, you know, for a dollar, but I got it for 25 cents. So we do like doing these. So that was a great deal. And then this was 25 cents too. It is a holographic art. It comes with little markers. So for 25 cents, that was a great deal. We love the Chronicles of Narnia and I don't think we have this one. It is the Chronicles of Narnia, the Voyage of the Dawn Treader. So it was a dollar, but that's the one. I asked my son, I'm like, do we have this one? He's like, I don't think so. So um, if we do, we'll just, we'll pass it on to somebody, but we love those movies. So we got that. I did find this, this great little craft organizer. Look at all the little compartments for just a dollar. I found four of these Rubbermaid uh, two quart square canisters. I got four of them for 50 cents each. They're in like brand new condition. And I tried peeling one a little bit and they seem to come off well. So I'm going to use these for my food storage um, for organization. So I got four of those. I was excited about those. Okay, so that was pretty much it. My son got stuff and my little one got stuff. And then we did get a... Um, they have their stuff everywhere though. We also got a box of all sorts of screws and nails already in their packages. Just a whole bunch of them for my husband for $2 and he was really happy to get that. So the next stuff is free yard sale, free yard sale stuff, and um, my parents just had a yard sale at their house this past weekend, and so of course my parents were like, just go through and grab whatever you want. And they just wanted to get rid of stuff, and they're happy to pass it on. So a couple of things, I have. There's a few big things. Um, two of those are vintage suitcases, a large one and a small one, which I have on display right now. So eventually I will take you through the house, not on this video, but another time, and show you those. So I have those, and then the other larger thing that I got from them was um three of these like um like pottery uh, mixing bowls uh very old and my mother had said that she believes that one or two of them were her great grandmothers so we're talking like maybe 1850 1860 um I think anyways <laughs> my husband's in the background <laughs> yeah he's being silly so uh I was really happy to get those especially where they were um you know, my great grandma, great, great grandmother. So I'll show you those at another point. Um, I did pick up this and I thought this was really cool. This is a leaf metal tray. And so I'm going to, um, use this when we're finished our backyard and we have it all set up and at one of the tables out there. So I love this. This is really cool. And I found this purse. I just, it, it looks like so it's not it, it's not vintage but it looks so vintage and I love stuff like this look at how pretty this is oh, it's so gorgeous I absolutely love it love it love it love it so I was so happy to get that I had to get some fabric my mom had a bunch of this she had a few other ones but this is the one I really loved um, this flannel checkered uh, fabric so got that and I got a nice large linen an older white large linen tablecloth for my big farm table so that will be great and then I also got a Christmas one a nice red Christmas one that will fit it as well so that was wonderful I found this little slip and I just thought it was so precious I'm gonna hang this in my little one's room but isn't that just like it's so vintage and antique and sweet oh look at the little detailing up here oh it's so pretty so I'm gonna hang that for display it's just so pretty okay that was so from another okay no let me stick with this hold on <gasps> not organized um the last thing that I had gotten from my my parents oh and I did get this little um veggie cutter 
to make the shapes. I thought that was fun. Um, and some, there's a few other things too, but the last thing that I got that I was really excited about was this box, and she had them three for a dollar. Of course, I grabbed the whole box because I'm going to use them all. And what they are is all sorts of little, and my mom's a big crafter too, which is back <laughs> there here. All these little um, ornaments, some little um, bottle brush trees. Um, show you. Some little angels, all for Christmas crafting, which I was so excited. And I love these little churches. Look at how pretty those are. So I got this whole box um, that I want to put away for Christmas crafting. I was super excited to find that. Um, and she was super excited to, to pass it along. So that was great. Okay, so that was everything from my parents. I just found some more stuff that I didn't show you from another yard sale. We found these little guys, and these are labeled Hong Kong, so they are old. And we got those for 25 cents each. We thought those were so cute. And I just, I found this. This was a dollar. This little um, wooden house. And I'm going to paint this for my little one's room, but just little things like that would be really cute in there, you know? So that was really fun to find. I love painting stuff, so I'm going to paint that. I did pick up a box at of old fashioned Christmas lights and in that was a couple of Snoopy things. And I do know somebody that likes Snoopy so I'll probably be sending those their way. But this is an old Snoopy book and an old um, 1977 Christmas ornament. So you probably know who you are but you'll be getting that as fresh mail. And then I found these which I was so excited about because I love old um, stuff in original boxes. And so these are the Christmas light bulbs in the original boxes. Look at how cool this is. And here's the back of it. Isn't that neat? I I was like so happy to find these. I'm gonna use these um, for display at Christmas time. I found two of those in the boxes. And again, there's the back. How cool, right? I don't know if there's a year. Westinghouse. Is there a year? I don't see a year. I wish there was so I could tell you how old they are, but Nonetheless, they are very cool. So I'm going to be using those as uh, decor in the house. I'm going to kind of put them in different places. And then there was, I just put them in this just because I had to wash them all, but a whole bunch of like just individual ones. So I'll be using those for crafting as well. And I think that is everything. That is everything. Um, I did also buy, um, it was a bench with the three bed big baskets um, that you would put underneath it. And so we, my husband, it was in rough shape. We paid $10 for it, but they go for so much more and I've been wanting one for my mudroom. So we just recently spray painted it um, a gray and reupholstered the cushion and it looks amazing. Again, I will show you this when I do like a little tour of, of some things that I've been working on. But that is it for now. That is all my yard sale and thrift finds um, that I have recently gotten. And um, I will show you more as they come. Thanks again, guys, for watching. We'll talk to you next time. Bye.